Hello, guys. Hello. 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 Welcome back to Archilago. <laughs> I'm trying. You, you were closer that time. All right. Yeah. That's good. Tiny islands. Uh, we're on the 13th island, and let's begin this monstrosity. Yeah. Hopefully, it won't take half as long as the next as the last one. <laughs> right. All right, so it looks like we have omelets, roaches, mirrors. That two by one platform on the left looks like it's the only thing you can actually kill anything with in the room. This. Ah, yeah. So, is there a reason we want um, these guys alive? Uh, well. I don't think so, but the problem is going to be in actually getting them out. Because if you push the mirror, you're going to get stunned. Right. And you can't unstun them with your... And you can't um, get block their rays with your sword because you don't have one. That's logic. Joy! Yay! <laughs> yeah, the moment I even move the mirror, it's going to... Yep. Oh, wait. You, you, could, you could put the platform... You don't have to go back to the beginning every time. <laughs> so you could put the... Pl I, I think this only works for the uh, the western one, but possibly you could move the platform so that it's um, one one west of where it is now. Oh, no, it's not going to work. Well... Yeah, um, no. If you could get rid of the roach first, then you could push the mirror southwest, and then uh, and then get rid of the mirror with the platform without ever stepping into the ray. But oh, well, there's a platform to the right, so we could use that platform too. It's only yeah. one by one. Yeah, but if we can add a, add them up, so it'd be kind of like um, uh, something like this. Oh yeah. Oh. There we go. There we go. Yay! All right. So now we have this guy alive. I don't. The thing about this is we're gonna have to hit the switch, and that means this guy cannot be looking at us. Yeah. That seems about right. So we're gonna have to so kill maybe... him somehow. I think we need to save the mirror. We need to... Yeah. So one of these mirrors are gonna have to stay alive, basically. Yeah. Well, wait, how are you going to get the mirror in there in the first place? That's a good question. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I hope, I hope this isn't what I think it's going to be, but... The, um, the east mirror can be pushed in four different directions. Or actually, five directions. The west one could only be pushed in two. So it's in a corner like that. Right. Now, how, do, how does this happen? It doesn't. I'm guessing you can't kill him here. Roy, you had it. I did? Yeah, it was on your platform. And I don't think you were stunned. Yeah. yeah. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but don't I have to go down? I don't think I can go down without him catching... Hmm. Wait, no, you didn't. What? I don't know why, but somehow you had him at one point. Don't Wait remember. one turn ah. and then try going southeast. Oh, right here. There we go. <laughs> or do that. <laughs> so then, okay, so we have to keep this mirror alive, right? Yeah. We can all agree on that. That's what I can see. Of course, now I don't know how to get that mirror into that little area to block the conflict in the first place which wait. is yeah then we can't use the mirror no we no wait no we can't so now the uh, so now the reason I was going oh no just now is because the only other way I could see of blocking the conflict is by bringing something in there and the only thing you can bring in is an conflict is not fun 
Jeff's, Jeff, I think Jeff's right. But it has to be done on the left, it looks like. Mm. Just because, doesn't it? Because oh, wait a minute. Push the, wait a push minute. the mirror I'm... out a bit further. I'm, g I'm getting something here. What if we did some crazy manipulation things and got the mirror to the east of the arm flick, had it turn itself on the mirror, and then use the platform to get to the, uh, to the door, to, uh, to the pressure plate? It's going to be insanely finicky, but it could work. True. Hmm. It's not what I wanted to do. I may need that spot. I am really bad with these things. I don't think this is going to work on this side, is it? I can't seem to get it to work. As well as it Yeah, did. there's a lot less uh, space to move around. So how do I even get... I don't even get this mirror. <laughs> <laughs> well, we could do some crazy maneuver where we get the other omelette over here, all the way over here, get them stuck on the mirror right there, then get this one to move and... Or instead of getting... You, you don't want him stuck on the mirror there, you just want him to be there, um, facing a different direction, so that the, um, so that the southeast orb glitch ray is momentarily blocked. And that gives you the turn you need to push the mirror away. Then both of them are, are free. Yeah. So I don't think we want to kill this one just yet. No. No. <laughs> okay. That would be too easy, though. Yeah, he's knowing um, Pen Wilder, he's probably going to want you to use every single thing to its full extent. Yeah. Oh, great. I can't have him right there. Come on. This isn't working very well. Um, un undo three moves. Okay. And then go northeast. Oh, not northeast. Um, go, go back to where you were. So north and then east, I think. And northwest. If you wait, I think he turns. Yeah. But you could get a head start by moving northwest, I think. Wait, yeah. just um. Okay, now wait again. Now you can get around him. Yeah. I can't jump corners. I don't think. Uh, but uh, you yep. can jump corners yep. on the ground. Get onto the ground. Oh. Okay, yeah. I'm trying to stay on the platform. <laughs> Alright. Conflict Sorry. level of advanced concepts is really nice. So I can keep them there for now. I don't know if that's good or not. Okay. So now what do we do with him? Um, well, you'll need the platform. You need, you'll need, yeah, you'll need the platform to be southeast of the mirror, and then get the ump glitch onto the platform. Yeah. I feel sorry for whoever ends up with the ump glitch level in entry point. <laughs> Why? Is it hard to make or something? Uh, there's just. There's just so so much so much um, so so much difficult manipulation that's going to be really hard to teach. Yeah. Well, that's why it's tier six. <laughs> okay, get you over there right. real quick. No. <laughs> <laughs> Up there. Thank you. All right, where do I need this platform? Uh, to the southeast of the mirror. All right. Yes. Right. Right. Um. There. Yeah. Should be good. No, uh, you just gotta get that guy out of the way. Yeah, he's gonna be a problem. He's always a problem. 
Alright, I need to get him somewhere less where he can't move as much, like back all the way over here. Can I just do that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so right there. Yeah. And then where am I trying and, to make him stand exactly? Uh, in the way of the mirror. Without it being stunned, of course. That's going to be a little tricky. Yeah. <laughs> well, you, I think if you did good manu uh, manipulation, you could get it behind that door with the roach. And then from the eastern area, you could move it around. Would this be easier if you left that platform there and ran over and got the one tile one as well? I was thinking about that. That yeah. too. That... Yeah, that, that'll be easier. <laughs> yeah, if you put the one-tile one on the right side of the two-tile one toward the top, then you can just step across the other omplex beam. Yes, that's true. If it can get in there, it can't. No. Oh, of course. Oh, well, no, no still... just move that out of the way and get it in there first. Well, you could yeah. still alternatively move at a, use the platform and move yourself around. You gotta park the two in a place you can get back to it. Yeah. Wait, no, I don't think you. Now I can't get this one yeah. in place. Yeah. Um, wait, no, you can move the move the one one to the right. No. The one no the one tile platform move one to the right. Oh, I see. Yes. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, now slip that in through there, and yeah, exactly. All right, now he's... I don't want him to go up just yet. Let me get the checkpoint. Okay. Of course. And that Always was, is the checkpoints. That, that was probably just difficult enough to be the right way to do it. Hopefully. We still don't yeah. really know what we do after we've got this, but at least it looks like we've made progress. No, wait, how are you going to make no, use I see, of this? I see exactly what's going to do after this. So, once it, the only reason we're doing this is to get the right omplic out of there. Then we can just kill both omplic, move the, move the mirror up to block the one on the right, and then we're done, basically. So the last trick is how do I make him look a different direction than he's looking? How do you move, move the mirror to block the one on the right? No, not the one on the right. The one, the top one. I meant. Yeah, it it doesn't fit through that little gap with, without a sword. No, I mean yeah. just to have it, just to have him staring at the mirror, and then use the roach to break him free. Well, something we could do is get an omelet in there, stand right there. No, somehow. no need, to, no need to do that. The the uh, the mirror just has to be, um, one, two, three spaces north of. The top omplic. There is no way the mirror can get in there, though. That's what yeah. There's not a way to push it in from right here without a sword. Even with the sword, I think it would still be impossible. Oh, you're right. Hmm. Well, yeah. So an omelet standing right here, and then the mirror right here, the omelet could stare at the mirror. But, but how do you get uh, yourself in there? Oh, that's really the question. I don't know, how do we get past this omelette? It might be better if that single platform was the bottom left. Yes, that that could be right. I think you could just use the platform, uh, the one square platform, to just uh, have it uh, move, uh, have, to allow you to move around on the right to manipulate the, the omelette uh, remotely instead. The thing is, I don't have enough turns for that. Yeah, but I mean, before you set it up like that, you wouldn't technically need that that set up in the first place. All right, but for okay, so hold on. So what I'm thinking is right here, this platform would go here. Now just take the platform with you to the to the right, and you can manipulate it dis uh, oh. from a distance from over there. Yeah, now I see what you're saying. There we go. Yep. And then uh, that's yeah, that's a lot easier. And now we have <laughs> two of them on the loose. 
<laughs> How fun. How do we even begin to get past these guys? Well, they, they will try to go around obstacles, so... They won't necessarily stun you if you step in front of that one facing east. They'll just keep going up. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This looks like madness. Yeah. I know. But now, the, now this is getting a bit tricky. <laughs> Alright. Okay, I got him stuck in there with him. Yes! All right, now what? <laughs> Without him <laughs> looking back up there. Face the mirror again. What? As soon as you go anywhere near it. So I have to get them stuck somewhere else. I. No, no. I think you had to. I think you had to move the mirror um, while the second Omplich was going past the first one's ray. So in instead of manipulating him from a distance like you did. Hmm. So then, in that case, let me try the idea I had. Okay, uh, right there. Put it right there instead. Alright. No, that's not what I want. Yeah, they'll go up first over priority. They take priority of going up. Why is this one not... Oh, there we go. There we go. Can I be fast enough? He's not standing in the right spot. No. No, he is not. Oh, wait. From in there, though. Why won't you... Walk in its ray. I don't think this is working very well. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not seeing this tool as working very well. Wait. Wait. Yeah. I got it. You got Yay. it. Uh, where do I? Now move you gotta it? get out. And where do I move it? <laughs> I think here for now is well, the best bet you have. We still haven't worked out the right, the correct solution to the top arm clutch. Well. Every bit of progress counts, I'd say. Yeah, but we need to stop and think what the overall strategy is because that will decide that will determine what we actually want to do with this mirror. Yeah. So it looks like it's very carefully set up, so it's impossible to get the. Um, actually, oh no, yeah, completely impossible. Should it? Should it be? What, sorry, what, what? What are you saying is impossible? Well, no, I'm saying it's it's very carefully set up to make it so the mirror is impossible to get to the top right. Okay, yeah. Yeah. So what about I, was the... I was trying to see if there was maybe a way to get platforms to, like, around the coast to sort of make it easier to do, but it can't be done. So what about this omelith standing right here, looking bottom left towards this mirror? Because if I kill this omelith, it should be easy enough to get this mirror uh, right over here and then standing right there. I don't, don't think it can be done, because to get an Omplich in there, bearing in mind that the top Omplich is going to look north himself once you're there, I don't see how that I don't see how that can be done. Unless you go around the left. So keep, keeping one Omplich hooked on those two, those two rocks would be Really great to have a pointer tool for this. Um, the two rocks right above where you are. Um, and then just go around the island. You can get go around clockwise without the Omplik looking north to you. Yes, but how do you get the Omplik there in the first place? Oh, uh, yeah. How does this mirror get anywhere in the first place? <laughs> Alright. Oh. All right. So I, right, so I could leave the mirror there. Yeah. But now you kind of need to 
know what you're doing uh, in, in terms of how to get that mirror placed where you want it to be because the object mm -hmm. might slip out. None of our theories so far have used the roach. I'm just thinking. But that's because the roach is released with the pressure plate, which is about the yep. uh, pretty much the end of the room. Yeah. The question is, why is it in the room at all? Because even if the roach weren't there, killing that omplitch would still be the same challenge. So maybe the, maybe the roach is actually there as a tool. Wait, is there any way to use the use both platforms to? Um... To, to like move the mirror maybe east of the omplic and get it caught that way? That's what I was thinking, but it doesn't seem exactly possible because I think you would need three platforms uh, of actually, length. Actually, no, I think, horizontally. I, I, think, I think it might be. Try pushing it onto the, uh, the two platform, then using the one to, to push it a bit further, then the one south of the two and push it from the two to the one. Then move the two a little bit and it's... Seems really, really tricky. It, with the moment it goes on the one platform, there's going to be no way to push it off unless the mm -hmm. original one was a one platform. We could put a one platform here, put a two platform here, push it up, use the one platform, push it up again, but then we need the one platform yeah. there. Or, better yet, we could yeah. just... Yeah, sort. that seems like it's the best way to try out. We could try it. Let's oh. You, you could. Let's you, try, you it. try it first. <laughs> Let's try it for the fun of it. I was actually it. suggesting that like several minutes ago. Yeah, because what I've just seen is, is so crazy that, you know, try anything else first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. First of all, killing you is the first priority. You won't do that with a tiny platform, though. Yeah, so let me grab a bigger platform. You're gonna need a bigger boat. <laughs> Jump on here, thank you. All right, so now we just need to do some crazy boat manipulation stuff. And we need the mirror to be back all the way over there. <laughs> all right, all right, so first things first, get the mirror back over. Uh, no, no, I think it's still possible. Yeah. There we go. Mirror's back in place. Okay. <laughs> um, so we can use this boat to push this up. We can use the smaller one to get in a better spot, maybe. No, I think you're going to want it to be on that lonely tile. Right. Because that's how you want it to be set up in the first place. So... so. No, wait, no, no, I mean, push it southeast instead of southwest. Right, yeah, but, um, the only problem is how are we going to push it this way without a two in there? Uh, maybe, hmm, okay, that's, that's actually somewhat interesting. <laughs> um. It might be impossible to do this. Hmm. Because the idea would be to push it onto that one, then push it on this two. Somehow get it there, Push somehow push this one up. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I do not know how this would work. <laughs> uh, so close. Now I want this to work, but... So do I. <laughs> Looks like some variation on this has to be it. Well, we could do the one platform and use it to... Um, push it on there, and then... Something like that? Mm. Actually, you could push that into the upper exit of the right omplic chamber you know, where the first one was, and then go in through the other end and use that to push the mirror north. Hmm, that's interesting. Could we, could we try putting the mirror up here and then pushing it down somehow this way? Or is that impossible? 
Well, then you need a pl uh, platform set up to, uh, in the line of sight of the arms, like. Yeah. And since they're all vertical, it's impossible. Um, well. If you if you could safely get to the north of the arms, like you wouldn't need to get to that platform, yeah. or you wouldn't you wouldn't need to block it. You could just get to the pressure plate. All right. Yeah. All right. Let's just try something like. Why does I feel like this is working, but then at the same time it's not working? So wait, is it working or not? <laughs> it would work if I could push the mirror up. <laughs> I think that's the problem with this idea. Yeah. Once it's on the single one, it's not moving an inch. Yeah. And there's no chance that we're not just like missing a platform or something. Yeah. Well, we could do it the opposite. Um, uh, I thinking somehow, no. All right, I don't think this is the solution. <laughs> I, think we can, yeah. I think it's agree, agreed. Maybe. So do you want me to tell you my absolutely crazy idea? Go for it. Well, you see how the obstacles in the middle of the room are arranged to make a kind of chain so that if you could just plug those gaps, you could bring the roach all the way across and have the roach block the omplich beam. Mm -hmm. Of course, the problem is finding suitable things to plug the gaps with. Wouldn't that and be a mirror? Well, you, you've only got one. If we have because one it dropped the other. Uh, yeah, you have, to, you have to drop the other. Otherwise, you can't get started on the whole chain of freeing the two arm clutch. So what I'm, thinking is, what I'm thinking is you put the mirror in between the two trees and keep both arm clutch alive and have both of them staring at the mirror. Uh, <laughs> I told you it was crazy. All right. The thing that scares me is that sounds exactly like... That sounds exactly like what the solution would be just judging from the previous rooms actually that uh, that's that seems like it makes sense because yeah it makes sense <laughs> oh dear <laughs> have fun you're not gonna help um <laughs> this this is manipulation there's only so much i can do <laughs> You know how with most rooms, when you find out the solution, there's sort of a sense of relief? There's none of that in this whole thing. <laughs> nah. Or in most manipulation puzzles. Uh, this is gonna be... No, gotta be quick enough. Um... This is not what I intended, but it works! <laughs> Alright, now I need you to move somewhere else. You're not in a good spot. How can I get him somewhere else, though? Uh, move around the top? What? Right, no, you can't. Actually, we'll use the idea of... There we go. Alright, now... Oh, gosh. These guys are gonna be running around everywhere. How do I control all of them? <laughs> Actually, if they're both stuck staring in a mirror that's adjacent to them, how do you get them free? Hmm. Yeah, that's right. Um, how are we going to even kill them? Because we could put a mirror here and have both of them there, but then how do we actually kill them? Yeah. Reuse, I mean, reuse the roach. Yeah, it could be the roach, or it could be the umplik again. Right, but if they're, if they're staring at a mirror, because if you place the mirror between those two bushes, it's going to be directly adjacent, so there's no spaces between the umplik and the mirror. To yeah. Uh, the, the mirror could be um, one square northeast, so just under the checkpoint. So they're both staring at it from two squares away. And oh, that works. Yeah. Um... But it... Yeah, it probably is this then. Or you could have the mirror right, um, sixteen, seventeen, right, uh, northeast of this bone patch, and then have them both looking down. 
And then when the roach walks by, we'll make the ominous uh, gaze stop. Yeah, I, I guess. Makes sense. And they almost have to turn to look away, and then they won't be stuck. Uh, what do I do about this omelette, though? I need you to go up there. Uh, this is going to be tough to set up. I can't have you look down, but I can't. Ah. Uh, okay. Complex. <laughs> I need this to be placed somewhere else. It's okay if that guy looks that way because he's. Uh, he's gonna be tricky to maneuver. He's the tough one. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So then we get you up here. I think you had it. Just keep moving to the northwest after that part and with the mirror. Yeah. Oh, yes. Now the mirror goes this way. Now we need the mirror to go this way. Can Almost I... got it. He's so close. Move away, please, from the mirror. It's okay if he looks, because he's going to stop looking. There we go. All right, the mirror's in place. Wow. Oh, that's, that's interesting. I didn't know Omplic Beams went through light things. Yeah, neither did I. In fact, I didn't even realize they had any puzzle potential until recently. What? Apparently, mm. explosions bl uh, go right through them. Yes, I remember, well, obviously I don't actually remember, but I've read about it on the forum, how in the first Elemental Showcase contest, um, someone surprised everyone by choosing light posts as his element. I was kind of hoping for um, something like that in the Elemental Showcase 5.0, but there, there just isn't anything in 5.0 that's that surprising. <laughs> yeah. Everyone picked Constructs. I noticed. Construct was the popular choice. <laughs> yes, four out of ten. Yeah. They're probably one of the most interesting elements introduced in 5.0, though. Right. One, of, one of the most horrifying. <laughs> yeah, definitely not my favorite. Well, I still can make a fair amount of puzzles with them, it's just... Yeah. As long as, the, yeah, as long as you, you avoid, like, manipulating them to drop trapdoors puzzles, like in Rapid Fortification. I don't know. The, the, the trapdoor puzzle in, what's it called, Foursquare was very good. Eh, true. It's just I was stuck on the one in Rapid Fortification for a What do I remember, the one in Rapid Fortification? The one with the dagger. Dagger? Yeah, because Rapid Fortification has one room with each weapon, and those are the really nasty ones. Um, the, the pickaxe one is the most evil room in the hold. I don't, know, I don't know about most evil in the hold, but definitely out of this, uh, that whole level, I can agree. Well, I got this one out. Yeah. <laughs> with some weird maneuvers, but... It happened. Good job. Yeah. Any maneuver counts as long as it clears the room to me. Even if it does take you almost a thousand moves. Uh, you you want to go up and around the skull pile, I think. The only way you can get him facing southeast. Um, southwest. All right. There we go. Yeah. Here we are. Ooh. Oh, and as, as, as a bonus, the roach gets both of those free as you right. go around. That's why this has to so, be done this way. Now let's see whether that was the solution or not. Yes, they both stop looking, and then our roach friend blocks off their view. 
Except yeah. probably should have done that with the, the two, with the two platform. Should you if you do if you do that with the two platform instead of the one, you can just kill them right off the bat. Alright, okay, back. <laughs> Time travel. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, here we go. <laughs> alright, um alright, let's try this again. Uh so how do I kill these guys? How do I get past them, even? That's the next part of this puzzle. I don't... Uh... Um, I, I think you want the, uh, you want the um, platform to be southwest of the pressure plate, so you can move as quickly as possible. Yeah. No, just... <laughs> no, no. You have to step on the pressure plate, so I meant. Oh, southwest, south right here. Yes. Okay. Good. I was thinking southeast for some reason. Okay, my bad. Now what? Uh, you want to stay on the top square of the platform so they can move on to the lower square, and try and. Oh. Yes, that works. That's it. Almost. But, almost, but you got you got one of them. So. If anything. It's a little bit easier. Yeah. yeah. Um, no, go go back down. Right. Um, yeah. So yeah. Um, east now. No. Undo and then east, then southwest, then north. That's it. Yay! All right. Now we just gotta kill the other two. By the same. Well, you do, yeah. You don't need to go anywhere. Just just kill them here. Um. Here we go. Woo! Yay. How long did that take? <laughs> now what? Oh, just move. But how long did that take? Um, 42 minutes. Oh, uh, you'll probably want to call it a part there then. <laughs> what I meant when I said now what was, is it going to be more or glitch next? But no, it is not, oddly enough. Oh. Yeah. No, no, I see one. Oh, this is like that room in... No, not really. No, there is an odd link. It's just oh, yeah. not easy to see. Anyway, <laughs> next time we will do this room. See you then, Yay. everybody. <laughs> <laughs>